A Child's First Impression of a Star by Nathaniel Parker Willis. She had been told that God made all the stars were twinkled up in heaven, and now she stood watching the coming of a twilight on as if it were a new and perfect world and this world's first eve. How beautiful must be the work of nature to a child in its first fresh impression. Laura stood by the low window with a silken lash of a soft eye unpraised, and a sweet mouth half parted with a new and strange delight of beauty that she could not comprehend but had not seen before. The purple folds of the low sunset clouds and the blue sky that looked so still and delicate above filled her young heart with gladness, and the eve stole on with its deep shadows, and she still stood looking at the west with that half smile, as if a pleasant fawn were at her heart. Presently, in the edge of the last tint of sunset, where the blue was melted into the faint golden mellowness, a star stood suddenly. A laugh of wild delight burst from the lips, putting up her hands. A simple fawn broke forth expressively. Father, dear father, God has made a star.